Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as Houston News. Today is January the 1st, 2021, the very first day of the year 2021. Hopefully this will be a very beneficial year for each and every one of you, especially those who are delving into this cryptocurrency sphere. Now today we're going to do an update on XRP, uh, but before I do, if you guys appreciate our videos and our content, make sure before you go, you hit the like button, share the video, also subscribe to the channel. And we are going to go live streaming this month so get prepared for that i just want to get everyone opportunity so we can together try to predict the market so we all can get an understanding and get in position as to where the market is likely to go so that we can profit so make sure you guys look forward to that during the month of january 2021 more information will be forthcoming so before i get started in our xrp prediction I wanted to show you something that is going on into the market today, right? So if you were to type into Google Monero delisting, and you guys can see one of the top stories today is that Bittrex is going to delist privacy coins, Monero, Dash, and Zcash. Today, January 1st, 2021, this information just came off the presses and it's having a major impact on these privacy coins on all the exchanges across the board. But there's something that I also came across that I wanted to share with you and is from a Reddit post. OK, very unpopular opinion, but I believe XMR will be delisted from every major exchange in 2021. And here's why. That was two years ago that this post on Reddit came out. Is it just a coincidence that today is the first day of 2021? And Bigtrex comes out stating that they're going to delist Monero, Dash, and Zcash. That's quite funny. That's, that's just a coincidence or either that person knew that in the year 2021 that the clampdown on privacy coins was going to occur on these exchanges. Just something I found odd that I wanted to share with each and every one of you in our community. And lastly, this is the other thing as to why Decentralized cryptocurrency exchange is going to be very important going into the future. Decentralized exchanges. When you have a decentralized exchange, no one entity controls it. So you won't have a Bittrex or a Coinbase or a Bitfinex or even a Kraken to delist these cryptocurrencies. It's decentralized. So you will always have a market for these cryptocurrencies. And I would expect as we go throughout the year 2021 and beyond that decentralized exchanges will become the norm or more people will find more interest in the exchanges once the priority exchanges cryptocurrency exchanges start delisting these cryptocurrencies so i just wanted to show that and explain that to each and every one of you and just let you know that was quite odd that that post was done about two years ago and on the first day of 2021 it gets delisted on bitrex so here is our forecast that we did for XRP about three days ago. Um, it was on December 29th, 2020, and we expected a market to go lower in price. And needless to say that the market in XRP did go lower immediately after we did our video. So you might not have even caught the market going lower in XRP, maybe two hours or four hours going into our forecast, the market trap went ahead and took the value of xrp back down to around 18 cents and that's where we had the market going so if you missed out on that then we have to look forward to the next opportunity for us to really see where the market is headed so that was about 12.4 percent within a very short amount of time congratulations to those who were able to get it and those who did not then you probably will hear this sound <laughs> Yeah, we missed out. OK, so those who didn't get it, we move on. Look for other opportunity opportunities that is here in this space for XRP. So that is done. That is over. So what we do now, we get rid of it. Now, one thing that you can see is that XRP is finding an area of trading that the trap enjoys right there around 18 cents. I will give it around 20 cents as that support area and now 25 cents that's restriction so we we found an area that the trap enjoys where he is finding buyers and sellers plain and simple 
Now the trap is the one who controls the market, he moves price. And so far, he is creating and showing us that he approves of 20 cents being support and he approves of restriction coming in around 25 cents. So now, let's take a look out on a bigger time frame to see exactly how the market in XRP looks. So you can see right here that we are now right back into an area of consolidational trading. We have identified the support area of around 18 cents. The restriction area will either be around 25 cents or 30 cents. Okay, 30 cents definitely is an area of restriction that the market in XRP or that the trap could not break across on numerous occasions. And he held it as support as well too. So we really need to identify that 28 cent, 29 cent area for restriction into the market for XRP. Okay, so we did that. Let's see how the market in XRP concluded on the monthly time frame. So when you look at this monthly time frame in XRP, very, very weak. The volume where we close that into the market in XRP definitely lets us know that all of that gains that was had in November, it is completely washed. It is gone and it took us 30 days at least to see the market from a monthly perspective to come all the way back up there towards 80 cents. And in less than 30 days, it came right back down to where the market in XRP has been consolidating. So. The next location would either be we're going to hold this consolidational trading range or we're going to break down and completely go down to the lows that came into the market in the XRP back in 2017, which is around 13 cents, 10 cents. Now, based off the price action, based off the volume from the last two months, the 13 cent is definitely something that we all need to consider. We need to see that occurring especially with the negativity that is going on around this particular cryptocurrency and how everyone is literally sitting on pins and needles trying to anticipate where the market is likely to go. Well, looking at this from a monthly perspective, definitely we need to keep our eyes open on this 13 cent level, at least for a quick touch. Okay. So the market in XRP is just consolidating for the moment nothing too bad nothing too drastic in sense of where are we headed this area right here 25 cents i'm telling you this now don't expect the market in xrp to go higher until we see him break that price above 25 cents so let's look at this on an hourly time frame to see if he's going to be able to do it because right now we're seeing him finding a very huge issue of breaking price in XRP above 25 cents. That's on the 11 hour time frame. On the five hour, we're still seeing the same thing. Let's take a look at an hourly time frame. And you can see here on the hourly time frame that the XRP market is finding issues around 25 cents. We were able to tag it just like we did on this particular one hour bar and we went down. The market in XRP is still trying to go higher in price, at least on an hourly time frame. I'm not telling you that the market is going to go higher on a time frame like on three days. OK, I'm not really seeing that the market in XRP is going to really break out above 30 cents within the next three days. But the strength is here into the market in XRP on an hourly time frame. I will tell you I will tell you all that. So what we're going to do into the market for this particular forecast in XRP, we're going to play the strength. Okay. We're going to continue to anticipate the market in XRP to go higher in price. Only thing that's in our way is 25 cents. The trap breaks that to the upside. We'll see the market in XRP try to do a quick test around 28, maybe even 30 cents. Okay. So we'll go ahead and do that there for the time being. It's going to have to happen relatively quick. We don't have um, a huge amount of time to really see this market in XRP try to go up there towards 30 cents. Okay. Our TP area would be around 25 cents as well, which is about 5% profitability in the market there. But 
we're going to look forward to try to tag out around 29 cents maybe even 30 cents over the next couple of days and that's it this is what we're seeing into the market for xrp not a lot we've been real accustomed to the market in xrp just bouncing in between uh 17 cents back up there towards 30. i'm pretty much seeing the same ideas to go on into the market for xrp at least until we get some clarification or the result the resolution of the sec court case against ripple okay so this is our idea as a community we want everyone else to get the opportunity to tell us what they see on the price chart let us know what you see you might see something totally different so that we can all come up with our own thesis as to where the market in xrp is headed where do you think the trap is going to take the value of xrp tell everyone leave us a comment in the comment section and please do not be complicated we are not a channel that disperses complication or even confusing price charts so tell everyone your thoughts what i'm going to do before i go i'm gonna bring this up just a little bit higher towards 30 cents okay and that's it questions comments let us know make sure you maintain a profitability go and trade different